Hello everyone and welcome back to our QT beginner series. PyQT beginner series, I always say QT. The QT is C++ and the PyQT is Python. Today we will take a look at how to display an image in PyQT 5. So if you have to show any image in our application, how do we do it? We will use the Q label together with the Q map to do that. Quickly, let's import both up here. The Q label is from the QT widget class and the Q map is from the qt GUI class from pi qt5 dot qt GUI we want to import q pix map this one and you have to also have the image also in your project folder or somewhere i will use this image of a cube a uh, person rolling a cube to do that it's inside my my directory just the directory where the python file is so what I do is that I first declare the label. So I don't even need to declare self because this one I'll not call it in a label equal to Q label. And that's it. We do not put anything there. We don't put any text in there because we are not displaying text. We are rather displaying an image. And then we create what we call a pix map. That's it. Pix map equal to kill pix map. We use that one to create an image pix map, which will be my cube.jpg. That will create a pix map from the image. And then we set the label pix map to that particular image. Label.set pix map, and then we set it to the pix map that we created. And that's it. We, 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 we are done. All that we have to do now is to add the label to the layout and then we can display it. Layout dot add widget. And then the widget we want to now add is the label. Now when we run our code, we should see our image displayed in the application. Now, of course, it's, it's very big. We have to resize it and all. But that is how to display an image inside PyQt applications using the Q label. Let us try and then resize our image. Resizing the image is quite easy. We just have to add the dot scale. That is to scale the image to the Qpix map. Dot scale. And then in here we can pass in the dimensions we want to. 200 by 200. I mean scale the image down to 200 by 200. When we run it now. We should see our image scale down. Of course, that was not the original resolution of the image. Um, yeah, you may want to use that one to do the computations and then scale it down properly. Let me try 400. Okay, this looks better. Maybe 300. Okay, this looks better. This looks better. This is how to display an image in PyQt5. We first declare the label, set the pix map to the image, scale it if necessary, and then set the pix map of the label to the pix map of the image we created. So thank you for your time. That will be all for this video. I'll see you another time with another video.